Are they looking at us? Yep. <sighs> Don't look at them. I wasn't looking at them. It's my idea to have breakfast in here, not hers. I don't know why she's copying me. How can she afford to go out for breakfast? She didn't give her any money, did you? No. Mm -hmm. Good. Don't, because she'll only waste it on that girl. They're talking about me. How do you know? Mum's lips are moving. Mm. You are not the centre of my mum's universe. No, but you are. I'm just an alien invader from outer space. Oh, really? And do you come in peace? No. I come to destroy your planet. <laughs> <laughs> They're laughing again. Did you see that? You told me not to look. Maybe we should go. This is a bad idea. Come on. Oh, we can just take a chill pill, Sally. The kids don't let them wind you up. I'm not wound up. Good, we'll eat your eggs. Look, I promise I'll pay you back. What do you want it for? Just in case. Just in case what? Just in case I see something that might want in town. What's up? Don't you trust me? Of course I trust you. I'm going for my mum. There you go. 30 quid, just don't waste it, OK? I will. Pass my heart up to Dad. Thanks, Dad. Love you. No booze, no tattoos. <laughs> Hiya. Hiya. You all right? Yeah. Uh, can I have a word? Privately. I'll go to my room, then. No, I'll sit down. Look, Dad, anything that you've got to say, you can say it to me and my dad. What exactly is going on with you, Pa? We obviously know by the way that you're asking. Oh, come on, Sylph. We've always been close, me and you. I'd hate to think you feel you've got to have a secret. We'll see each other. Oh. <laughs> well, thanks for being honest with me, at least. <laughs> and you're keeping this a secret from your mother, why? You know, you know what she's like, Dad? Look, I know she doesn't deserve being lied to. Especially not under her own roof. Now then, I know about this 30 quid you had off your father. So? No, Kevin, it's a lot of money and I want to know what you wanted it for so urgently. Because if I find out you've been getting out of your mind on booze, or God forbid drugs... Mum, I don't do drugs. So, they're not doing drugs. Well, what are they doing then? Each other. But... You're not gay. Well, I am giving it a damn good go. Hey, no need to be cheeky. Sophie? We, we just wanted to make sure it was real, Mum, before we started telling everyone. Oh, please, it's been going on weeks. How do you know? What? But you knew and you didn't tell me. Yeah, she was, she was blackmailing me. Blackmailing you? About what? About the burglary, yeah. It wasn't no six-foot bruiser that he tackled, it was me. You? Why would you lie to me? Because he wanted everyone to think that it was dead big and hard. Uh, no, 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 it wasn't like that. Kevin, I think you should go. Why? Right. what have I done? I want to talk to these two. I just feel so stupid. Stupid and laughed at. Nobody laughed at you. Of course not. Look, I really am grateful for everything that you've done for me, OK? And I know that I don't come across as the touchy-feely type. Oh, shut up. This all started with you. If we hadn't gone to the flaming soup kitchen in the first place... Mum! And you can pipe down and all. Who do you both think you are? Lying to me, plotting behind my back. Fine. I guess I should get going then, shouldn't I? Not it. No, your mum's right. I knew I should never have come back. No, you shouldn't. No, Maddie, will you? No, don't come after me, OK? I mean it, don't. 